OpenAI, the makers of ChatGPT, are out with a new model AI called GPT-40. Supporters say the latest artificial intelligence language model will make ChatGPT smarter and easier to use, and it will be free. ABC 7 News reporter Suzanne Fawn is live in the newsroom with a look at exactly what this thing can do, Suzanne. So Dan Dion, GPT-40 will turn ChatGPT into a digital personal assistant. It can engage in real-time spoken conversations, and it can interpret and generate text, images, and audio. Not everyone's on board with the changes, though. In the Mission District at OpenAI headquarters, dozens of demonstrators demanding to pause AI. I'm not upset because we're not anti-technology. We love that GPT can be useful. So we're sounding the alarm that we need to hit the pause button. It's too soon for us to be able to handle super, uh, superhuman intelligence because we need more research into how to make it safe. OpenAI, Google, Meta, they're all working to build increasingly powerful large language models that power chatbots. Today, OpenAI unveiled GPT-40 and it's making it free to all users. GPT-40 provides GPT-4 level intelligence, but it is much faster. The updated experience will allow users to interact with it on desktop and through improved voice conversations. Hey, ChatGPT, I'm Mark. How are you? Oh, Mark. I'm doing great. ChatGPT 4.0 will use text and vision. It can view screenshots, photos, documents, or charts uploaded by users and have a conversation about them. Tech expert Professor Ahmed Manafa explains. It's basically uh, listening and can see through the camera and can give answers. Open AI executives demonstrated a spoken conversation with ChatGPT to get real-time instructions for solving a math problem, to get coding advice, and to tell a bedtime story. Once upon a time, in a world not too different from ours, there was a robot named Byte. OpenAI presenters also showed the model detecting users' emotions. How do you feel? I feel a lot better. Thank you so much. OpenAI says ChatGPT 4.0 will be free for all users. Paid users will continue to have up to five times the capacity limits of free users. It's a smart move because they can get the data. That's very good. This is, this is one way to train the model more and more. It's another step, you know, uh, towards uh, uh, something we call is the the, you know, the perfect AI, which is basically the AI will have all the five senses of human, and we can see it, you know, advancing very fast, more than what we expected. This open AI announcement comes a day before Google's big I.O. developer conference. The tech giant is expected to announce updates to its Gemini AI model. Live in the newsroom, Suzanne Fawn, ABC 7 News. Ah, the AI developments never end. Suzanne, thank you.